Hello Nigerians, I am Hosanna David. I want to quickly give this piece of advice to every Nigerian even as we prepare for the 2019 general elections. As we all know that many of us, not all of us, but majority of Nigerians are suffering because of the kind of bad leadership this country has produced over the years. Not everybody is suffering it because we have just the few cabals, few thieves, criminals, robbers who are benefiting from the hardship of the poor masses. What I want to say is this. If you know anybody that has been convicted or he was accused and there are clear evidences against him or her in this country and the person is running for a public position, please do not cast your vote for them. Let's we compound the problem that this country is having. Uh, we all know that ma majority of the states in Nigeria have borrowed money that this generation can't even pay. Even the next generation will not be even will not be able to pay them the debts, the money they have borrowed. The country, Nigeria, the federal level, has borrowed a lot of money too. So we shouldn't compare the problem for the unborn generation. We know that uh, uh, the generation that is coming now, their lives are at stake. Their destinies are at stake. Public schools are shutting down. In fact, they are on the death row. They're on the death row. Let us do the best we can. Please vote for your conscience. If you are a Nigerian and you collect money to vote for criminals, the unborn generation will not forgive you. Their sweat will judge you. If you are a Nigerian and you decide to compound the problem that we have by voting, if you pick, if God wakes you up this February 16, if God wakes you up in any other election than this 2019 and you pick up your PVC to go and vote for a criminal, God will judge you, you will face judgment. If you collect money and you vote for criminals to continue to enslave us in this country, God will judge you. The earth, this Nigeria, this Nigeria will judge you. Because we, everybody is complaining, these politicians are corrupt, these politicians, and you collect money, they bring rice, they bring yam, they bring uh, 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 salt, and you take. Even I saw uh, 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 a politician printing his picture, campaign pictures on Kuli Kuli. This is nonsense. People collect this. If you collect money and you vote, some of you said it's our money. They stole it. But I am not saying... You should not follow what you want. But if you collect money and you put, you cast your vote for a known criminal, your children, the unborn generation will judge you. If you don't repent, you will end up in hell because you are a part of the problem. Why not you vote for your conscience? Some of you say, even if we vote, it will not count. Don't worry. Use your PVC to do revolution. We are not saying we should go and fight, but your PVC, cast it for your conscience. Let your conscience control you. If you don't have conscience and you vote for people who don't have conscience and you prolong this slavery that we are in, I tell you, the edge of this Nigeria will also question you. Thank you. Share this video to everybody. Don't vote for criminals. Thank you. Bye-bye.